In this session we will learn about how to recover lost partitions in 5 minutes, when a hard disk loses its all partitions. We will also learn about the pre-mode shifting of the partitions. First of all we check the hard disk into the system. For this we right click on my computer and then we click on manage option. Here in device manager we click on disk drive option. Where we see that there are two hard disks. First is the hard disk of 1 TB. The second is the hard disk of 2 TB. Now we check these hard disks in disk management. Here we can see two hard disks. We can see this first disk is disk 0 and second is disk 1. Disk 0 is a basic disk which has three partitions. The first partition is system reserved partition. The second one is C drive and the third one is D drive. Similarly disk 1 is also a basic type hard disk, which has three partitions. The first partition is E drive having the capacity of 593 GB. Second one is F drive with the capacity of 683 GB. And the last one is partition G with 585 GB capacity. Now we check all these partitions in my computer. We can observe that we can see all the partitions in my computer. Here C and D drive are the partitions of disk 0. And E drive, F drive, and G drive are the partitions of disk 1. The data is stored in all these drives. Friends, many times when we upgrade Windows operating systems, or install a new Windows or we convert a dynamic hard disk into a basic disk then the particular hard disk shows the unallocated partition. The data stored in all the partitions is lost. In these cases we have two options for data recovery. In the first method we use any licensed data recovery software and scan the hard disk whose data is to be recovered. Then, and we recover the data from the regenerated partitions. And then copy that data in another hard disk. Then we create the partitions in the client's patient hard disk, and copy the recovered data into the client's patient hard disk. This is very lengthy and time consuming process because, if the size of hard disk and data is 1, 2 or 4 TB, then the scanning and saving of recovered data consumes a considerable time. In this second method we use a software, which search the lost partition according to the partition table. It recovers the partition layout and then checks the data. After checking the data we can fix the partitions on patient hard disk. By doing this we get all the data back and we don't have to copy the data into another hard disk. By this method we can recover up to 4 TB hard disk in only 5 minutes. The deleted and formatted partition data recovery is explained in the logical data recovery training session. Now we get ready to learn the data recovery process through second method. For this we will use partition guru software and first of all, we will check hard disk in the disk management option. Here in disk management, we are deleting all the partitions of secondary hard disk. Now the hard disk is showing an allocated space. Now let us learn about the process of partition and data recovery of this hard disk. For this first of all we run partition guru software. Here we can see both the hard disk. The first hard disk is disk 0 which is our main system hard disk. Here we can also see its partitions. Second is a 2 TB external hard disk. All the partitions of this hard disk are lost and recovery of partitions and data of this hard disk is to be done. 
For partition recovery we select this patient hard disk and click on the partition recovery option. Here we select whole disk option and click on the start button. Here we can see that our first partition which is a 593 GB is visible. And its all data is also visible. Click on the reserve button to reserve the partition and data. Second the 683 GB partition and its all data is visible here. Again click on the reserve button to reserve this data and partition. Now the last partition which was a 585.9 GB and its all data is visible here. Click on the reserve button to reserve this partition too. All the data and partition are visible in the left side. Now check the partitions in my computer. In my computer there are only C and D drive are visible. The reserved partitions are not visible here. To fix these partitions click on save all button in partition guru software. Now the partition layout saving process has been started. Now. The process of creating partitions is started. Now we can access these partitions and its data directly in my computer option.